Hey guys, it's Mo Stuff Stuff from Instaloon back with another tutorial. This is a original design by Ash1124 on Instaloon. It is a super pretty bracelet. It is fairly quick to make, so you could of course make a bunch of them, or if you just um, want to make something really quick, this would definitely be um, a fast bracelet. Um, as you can see, one of my bands got twisted on my bottom heart. So now it looks all funky, so that will be my first warning to you guys. Make sure that when you pull your bands through, they look straight or you'll get a funky heart like I did. So before I get started, I just wanted to make a quick announcement. Um, Ash1124 from Instaloom um, is going to be assisting me with um, tutorials for you guys, um, tutorial ideas, charm ideas, um, anything that we can basically come up with to try to put out the best tutorials for you guys, we're going to do that. Nash1124 from Instaloom is going to be helping me with that, so that's awesome. Thank you to her. Um, and also, uh, it would be awesome if you guys could go follow her on Instaloom. It's Ash1124. I'm sure she would appreciate it. So this is what I'm going to be teaching you today. So let's just get started. First things first is this is a hook-only design. So we're going to start by making a single chain for your sides. So I do 10 links. So I start with one cap band. I'm going to use my black. And I pull up 10 links. So one. Oops, two. Three. Sometimes they don't want to go through. Sorry, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. I find this is just the perfect link if you do three hearts. If you do more, just two hearts or one hearts, you're going to have to figure out how many links you need. So that should be 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, my last one. So you just pull it through like a single chain. Now here's where things get a little different. Once you have your 10 links or however many you want to use, you're going to start by taking your next color and we're going to pull it through. So I'm going to show you two different ways to do this. First way we're going to do this is you're going to just pull the first band over onto your, um, this one's teal for me reattach then pinch it remove your hook flip it around oops, stick it back through on the other side and we're gonna pull up another teal band okay now before we reattach just let it fold there put your finger on the top band just to keep it we're gonna take our third color mine's gonna be yellow now we're gonna grab a hold of this band that's just hanging here like this and pull the yellow through just these two. Like so, and reattach. And then you can now take your blue back on. So there's your first heart. Now we're going to take a black and pull it through everything on your hook. Like so. Oops. Okay. Then we're going to take one more black and pull it through the two that are already on your hook. Like so. Now we're going to start the heart again, okay? So I just showed you one way to do it, which is just to pull the first one over. Here's how I do it so I don't have to take it off my hook. I take the black and I hold it with my fingers, like so, while I have the blue wrapped around my middle finger. Now I'm going to pull it through this band here that's left on my hook and reattach, like so, and then reattach the black. So then all you have to do now, instead of taking it off your loom, is you just pull the first black one over. I'm going to show you the one, I'm doing three hearts, so the next one I'll show you is the, how you take it off the loom one again, or off the hook. So now what we're going to do is you can take this band here off, let it hang for a second, slide the yellow band onto your middle finger like so, and then find that band again. Pull, here, sorry, no, let's do it on this finger. So put it on your... I guess that's your pointer finger or whatever. I'm not good with that either. 
hold the blue band that's down here with your finger. Sorry, teal band. It looks blue in my camera. That's why I keep calling it blue. And pull it through just these two bands here, leaving the last band on your hook. Turn around, pull it through, and reclaim. Then reclaim the blue again, or sorry, the teal. I'm going to try to call it teal. If I call it blue, just you know the difference between blue and yellow, so I'm sure we can figure that out. So again, you're pulling a black band through everything on your hook, like so. Another black band, again, through these two black bands. And I'm going to show you the last heart. You can make as many or as little hearts as you want. Um, I saw one that Ash did that had um, one heart, two hearts, and I believe three hearts. I really like the three heart look. It's really cute. So again, we're going to take our blue band once we have the two links up from your last heart. Pull it through your first black band. So I'm going back to the original way of showing you how to do this. Pull the black band on just the one and then reclaim. Pinch it. And remove your hook, turn it around, stick your hook back through the other side. Take another blue band or a teal band, whatever. Put it on like that. I just put my finger here and let it rest for a second while I get my yellow band. Slide your yellow band onto your pointer finger. And then re grab that blue band there. Now you're going to stick your hook through the yellow and pull it through just these two bands here. Like so, and reattach. I just do both sides at the same time. You can reattach one at a time. Like if you're still holding this one, then just put the blue back. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do our last 10 chains. Okay, so we're going to start with one by pulling it through everything on your hook. So that's one. And now we have to do another nine. So you're going to pull it through one. That's the source. Two. Three. So there's three, four, oops, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now, of course, I did not get out a C-clip, so I am apologize about that, but basically, you're just going to C-clip these two bands here, and then you have your Love Stripe Bracelet. It should look something like that. See, this time I didn't mess up my bottom one, so it came out a lot nicer. I made sure they were straight. So that's kind of the two bracelets um, options. This one's with pearl, and this one's just with opaque. I think they're both really fun and pretty looking. You could wear them both together. Like I said, I messed up on my bottom heart. So it's all twisty and funky on this one. Whereas I didn't on this one. I made sure everything was straight. So that's definitely a tip I'm giving everybody. So again, this is an original design by Ash1124 on Instaloom. It is called the Love Stripe. And um, I would definitely recommend making this. It's very... Um, quick and very easy but totally really pretty and cute and just fun so thank you so much for watching this video I will be back soon with another tutorial I currently have one for the monster tail I want to teach you guys so I will be back soon hope you guys enjoyed it have a great day bye